Hey guys, this is Ray Andre. I'm a music producer from Florida, Florida man. And today I'm gonna to be reacting to BTS. And this video I found from Vice, I trained with BTS on the brink of fame then losing it all. <laughs> this sounds like it's gonna be very, very interesting. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's go. I still can't believe it. Like I just, started to watch this and I can't believe that this is actually real. I remember hearing about the Beatles, uh, which is, you know, one of the most famous bands in history and someone, something like that happened to a drummer. He was going to be the drummer of the Beatles, be famous, and he ended up not being famous. So I'm just so interested. I'm sorry. I, let's just keep going. I'm, I'm so interested in this. <laughs> He was actually their friend. Their friend. That's crazy. I still can't even imagine how much fame is actually like how famous BTS is, you know, around the world, everywhere, not just in Asia, not just in America, just around the world. And um, just, you know, it's just crazy. To, it's, it's inspirational. <laughs> I got no words. Wow. Uh, 저는 김지훈이라고 하고요. 어, 유튜브 크리에이터 비툰으로 활동하고 있습니다. 어, 저는 예전에는 방탄 연습생 출신이었고 지금은 그냥 공공기관 인턴으로 평범하게 지내고 있습니다. 반갑습니다. He seems so nice and humble and the fact that he knows he knows that you know he could have been and, and wasn't. Um, you know, that that's pretty humbling. That's like, he's got to be humble enough to admit that, to admit that he almost had it. He was almost there. And, and now he's just, he's a normal life, you know? It started out as a as a hip hop group, right? It was like a hip hop group. So um, I think so, right? Someone can correct me in the comments, let me know. But I think it was a hip hop group at first, and then it kind of grew into this pop, you know, and everything type of music. 크게는 안 했어요. 아 오늘 저희 여기 옆에 하이브 뮤지엄 옆에 있는 이제 아미 방탄 팬분이 이제 카페를 이렇게 이제 디자인하신 곳이 있다고 해가지고 한번 놀러 왔습니다. 근데 보면 되게 굿즈랑 이렇게 다 엄청 다양하게 있더라고요. 그래서 너무 잘 꾸미셔가지고 굉장히 놀라는데 저는 진짜 이렇게 볼 때마다 좀 감회가 좀 새로운 것 같아요. 어 <웃음> 일단은 좀 their faces are everywhere. 엄청나게 많은 팬덤이 생겼잖아요. 전 세계에 되게 다양하고 그다음에 뭐 남녀 가릴 거 없고 남녀 노소 가릴 거 없이 정말 다양한 연령층에서도 되게 팬분들이 많이 생겼는데 이런 거 보면은 좀 신기한 거 같아요. 20살 이후로부터는 이제 연생 친구들 다 거의 연예계 데뷔한 친구들이 많아서 연락을 이제 못 하고 막 이러다 보니까 이제 아예 못 보게 된거 자체가 좀 뭔가 아쉽죠. He says he can't see them anymore, but I'm sure that if he would reach out to them well, maybe he can't reach out to them, I don't know. But I think that the boys would probably, you know, if they find time um, out of their busy schedule to, to hang out with him or something, I, I would think that, I don't know. I think that I was a really young girl. When I was doing it, I was really good at the stage. 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 
제 안에 잠재된 이 끼를 지방을 돌아다니시면서 신인 개발팀 분들은 이제 이렇게 서치를 하거든요. 연습생 이렇게 뽑아 가세요. K-pop. 언제 한번 오신다길래 이제 K-pop recruiters. I've never heard of that before. They actually have K-pop recruiters to go and look for talent. You know, I didn't know that. 찍고 가셨어요. 그러고 나서 며칠 뒤에 연락이 또 오신 거죠. 아, 저희가 본사에서 오디션을 이제 보고 싶은데 참여해 주실 수 있나요? 하시는 거예요. 그래서 아, 이건 기회다. 진짜 이건 딱 느낌이 왔어요. 어, 제가 연습생은 18살 때 이제 딱 10년 전이죠. 그러니까 2011년부터 12년도. 너무 기쁘잖아요. 사실 그 인생 첫 오디션이고 한 번에 뭔가 합격을 했 So they go around looking for talent and then they find talent um, ask them on an audition and now you know they go out I, I wonder what specifically they're looking for you know like I wonder if they're looking for for singing skills dance, dancing skills probably all the above a certain look um, they're probably looking for all of that and I, and I also I wonder what at what age this happens are, are they looking for you know 12 year old boys are they looking for like 15 16 year old boys um, or does age not really matter as long as they're young you know like under 25 or so uh, this is so interesting to me you know I just I wanted to react to this, this is not my usual reaction I usually react to uh, more like music because I'm a music producer uh, but this is so interesting to me by the way if you want to support these reactions in my channel please uh, click the first link down below um, and it's just my website where you can support me it's only two dollars a month so you know it's it's really makes the big the biggest difference um, it doesn't it's not much but it makes the biggest difference just to know that there are people out there supporting this channel. But yeah, again, this is something uh, I never would have imagined. I just never would have imagined. Hmm. You know, usually most people, when they go through something like this and they don't end up getting what they wanted in the end, they become bitter. But he doesn't seem bitter. He seems like, you know what, I, that's what I wanted. I didn't get it. And now I live this life. Um, but he kind of reminisces. It's like a reminiscence of that, that was a really great time. The best time in my life, he says. I, again, I really like how humble he is in this. Uh, 두려움 반, 그 다음에 너무 기대되는 거 반. 두려움이라는 그 감정은 어떻게 보면은 그거였어요. 내가 막잘 못하면 어떡하지? 왜냐면은 워낙에 연습생이라는 게 실력이 진짜 갖춰진 친구들이 진짜 많아서 저는 정말 부족하다고 생각을 했거든요. 이 장소는 이제 저희가 이제 숙소 생활을 했었을 때 이제 저희 숙소였거든요. 숙소가 그렇게 저희가 막 좋지든 좋은 환경은 아니었어요. 사실 막 크지도 않았고 되게 투룸에 이제 한 여덟 명이서 많이 살았어요. 여덟 wow. 명까지도 살았었었는데 굉장히 추억이 좀 많이 있는 장소라고 할수 있죠. You know, I totally get this. This is like college, but on steroids. Like you go to dorm, you go to college, you have your college mates, um, you have a good time. But this is like you're doing, you know, something for a career or what could be your career in the end. Um, I really, really wish that there was a documentary on the auditions because that's the, the way this is all planned from the start is really, really interesting. How Wow. You see, I wonder how they like they chose these people and if they had a, you know, there are seven members, right? Am I right in there? I think I'm correct. There are seven members in BTS. And if they wanted it to be seven members from the start, or if they wanted it to be 10 and then they dwindle it down or maybe five and then they, they ended up adding two more because they saw their talent. 
저 같은 경우는 연습생 하루 스케줄이 아침에 보통은 이제 8시쯤에 뭐 일어나서 학교를 가는 시기에는 이제 학교를 가서 이제 정규 수업만 맞추고 와가지고 레슨을 이제 하죠. 근데 그러니까 저희는 좀 똘똘 뭉쳐가지고 연습을 했던 것 같아요. 그러니까 개별 연습도 하긴 했지만 그 개별 연습이 개별 연습 같지 않은 개별 연습이었죠. Yeah, you see, dancing seemed like one of the biggest parts of it. Like, dancing was a big part of this. And I personally, because I'm more of a musician and music producer, I really appreciate the dancing because I, all I, I like to dance, but I've never been that into dancing to, to appreciate it. So when I see these boys that sing and dance at the same time, <laughs> I've said this in the channel a lot of times, but it's really impressive. Actually, 어, 혼자 연습하는 것보다 근데 같이 연습해서 누가 들어주고 그러면 또 친구들끼리 그게 커져요. 아, 얘 되게 좀그 순간 늘었다. 그러면서 이제 하루를 보내고 그런 것들이 이제 모여 가지고 이제 계속 발전을 해서 되는 거죠. 이쪽으로 이제 가면은 이제 저희 건물이 나오는데 예전에는 빅히트가 정말 작았어요. 1층하고 2층 정도밖에 이 건물을 쓰지 않았었고 So even BTS had small beginnings, you know. It wasn't like they were already really huge like the project i'm talking about from the start that's so so interesting i keep saying that but i i really am this is so interesting to me 지금 하이브로 보면은 거의 뭐 건물 통째로 다 쓰고 있는 거 보면은 아 진짜 정말 많이 발전했구나 그런 거를 느끼고 오랜만에 한번 건물 보면서 한번 이렇게 보겠습니다 see back in the day it was like a record label building now it's an entire just artist group building. <웃음> 보통 이제 저희는 연습실에서만 생활을 하니까 회사로 올라오라는 말은 아 무언가 잘못됐거나 음. 아니면은 이제 좋은 일로는 잘안 갔던 것 같아요. 약간 좀 혼나야 되는 일이 있거나 약간 그랬었을 때뭐 음. 레슨을 뭐좀 늦었다거나 뭐 주기적으로 아니면은 뭐뭐 뭐 관리를 좀잘 못했다거나 약간 그런 부분이 있었을 때 이제 많이 왔었을 때 약간 회사에 이제 간다는 거는 아좀 두려움의 대상이었던 것 같아요. 두려워요. 회사에서 이제 전화가 오면은 어 지훈아 뭐 회사로 올라와 그러면 이제 아 무슨 일이 있겠구나. 근데 저는 그때 당시에 딱 느낌이 왔었어요. 사실 목소리에서 느껴지더라고요. 아 오늘 좀 뭔가 좀 말씀을 하시겠다. 그래서 이제 올라와 가지고 이제 문을 열고 딱 들어가니까. 되게 조용하신 거예요. 지금 사실 뭐 이렇게 회의가 나왔는데 너가 이제 앞으로 우리랑 이제 함께 음. 못할것 같다. 오, 와, wow, this is kind of early. This is kind of early for him to. He said he was going to get cut, right, from the group. It's kind of early in the video. It's halfway through. 그때는 근데 사실 앞에서 못 들었어. 혼자 그 공원이 있어요. 그 많이 가던 공원이 있는데 거기에 앉아가지고 그냥 진짜 한 순간 나오더라고. 나는 막 열심히 하고 맨날. 열심히 하고 맨날 진짜 세미 연습도 하는데 왜 나는 안 wow. 될까? 왜 제가 또 실력적으로 수명수도 hmm. 많이 겪고 많이 이렇게 다운 그레이드 되고 있으니까 저는 그냥 받아들일 건 받아들이자 이 생각을 갖고 이제 조용히 이제 나중에 마지막 나갈 때 그냥 애들한테 얘기해야겠다. 근데 그 친구들은 너무 안타까워해 줬어요. 진짜 막. See again, I wonder what it is that they were judging him on. You know, like. Specifically, was it his dancing? Like, what skills were they judging him on? It had to have been like his dancing, his singing, and if to see his improvements, if he was good enough. Um, if there was a documentary on that man, I, I'm sure all of us would, would love to watch it. That's true, because he could have gone to a different um, agency, right? He could have, he could have said, let me turn this on back here. He could have gone to a different agency, right? He could have gone to a different agency and said, hey, these are my skills, you know, and see if he could make it that way. But I wonder how old he was and uh, why he didn't pursue that. Outside of uh, BTS. BTS. 
진짜 힘들게 했었거든요. 와우, wow, that must have been so depressing for him. That's that's crazy. That must have not been just a big deal to him, but also to his family, you know? 그러니까 이제 좀 학교를 좀안 나갔었어요. 막 그때 막 멘탈이 나가지고 학교 일부러 막 빼먹고 막 이랬었었는데 이게 졸업식 그 당일이 제 졸업식하고 RM 졸업식이었었는데 They graduated at the same time. 연습했던 친구들이 이제 다 같이 졸업식을 와준 거죠. 제 졸업식 와가지고 같이 이제 사진 한 번씩 찍어주고 그냥 맨날 같이 보던 애들이 어느 순간 없고 이러다가 또 이렇게 같이 이렇게 뭉쳐가지고 얘기 나누고 밥 먹고 하다 yeah. 보니까 또 너무 좋은 거예요 그날. 그래서 조... So yeah, he was friends with all of them. 근데 그렇게 나서 또 저녁에 다들 이제 다시 원래 자기 자리로 돌아가고 저도 이제 집에 가고 막 이러는데. Alright, guys, this is this is way more uh, sad than I imagined. Like, this is really, really uh, something else, man. I, I didn't think it was gonna be this this deep, you know. 또또 우울해지더라고요. 데뷔하기 전에 한번 찾아간 적이 있었거든요. 마지막으로 그때 제가 치킨을 두 마리 사들고 원래 숙소 들어가면 안 되는데 그냥 이제 몰래 갔어요. 가면 안 됐지만. 몰래 가가지고 치킨 먹으면서 이제 너네 진짜 데뷔하는 거야? 너네 이름 뭐야? 이러니까 진짜 방탄소년단으로 확정한 거야? 이러니까 방탄소년단으로 확정이 돼서 나간다는 거예요. 뜨기 전에는 그냥 Yeah, BTS, the name in itself seems like even in Korean it would be it's an interesting name, right? 얘기를 좀 편하게 하고 다녔어요. 저 그냥 뭐 옛날에 어디 연습생 했었다. 이제는 말을 함부로 못 하겠더라고요. 왜냐면 갑자기 이제 막 너무 이제 인기도 많아지고 너무 유명해지다 보니까 지금은 제가 선뜻 먼저 말을 안 하거든요. Yeah, I imagine that uh, with everything in life, like if you are doing something and it, it doesn't turn out that you're like massively famous and everyone in that you stop doing something and everyone that was involved in that thing ends up being massively famous and rich and you're not massively famous and rich, it's kind of like, well, I don't want to be associated with them because uh that means that there was something wrong with me right something went wrong where where i wasn't able to be that along with them there's a lot of introspection here there's like a lot more introspection that than you would think you know this is like it makes you think about life it's not just it's not just about bts it's like i'm thinking about my life about other people's lives and, and how i perceive their lives and how my life may be perceived by others right 아, 너 어색하지, 진짜? 어색하지? <웃음> 아, 그러니까. 너무 오랜만인 거 아니야? 뭔 소리야. 뭔 소리야. 너가 더잘 듣는 거지. 어? 아유, 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 감사합니다. <웃음> 아, 진짜. 안녕하세요. 안녕하세요. 우와. 진짜 엄청나네, 이거. 그러니까. 장난 아니라니까? 똑같아 똑같아 안 변했어 안 변했어 어... 바닥에 앉아 어, 안녕하세요 안녕하세요 기환이 이거 오래간만인데 예, 이름이 뭐지? 저 제가 지환입니다 저는 아, 지훈이 아 지훈이 <웃음> 제가 아... 8년 만에 뵙는데 맞아요 진짜 아, 저도 So is that another one of the guys I guess? 어, 그 정도죠 8년 더된거 같아 저는 사실... 얘네들이 데뷔한 지가 That's almost 10, 10 years ago 10년을 데뷔했으니까 어, 저, 8, 저희보다 8, 8주년이야 8주년 맞아요 8주년 맞아요 아, 그렇게 올해 8주년 됐어. 그렇게 됐어 저희 스무 살때 맞아요. 저희 근데 연습생 때도 이제 다 같이 와가지고 막 먹고 그랬었잖아요. 와. 얘들 자리 아니야 여기. 여기 네 맞아요. 여기 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 여기, 여기, 여기. 아, 맨날 이 자리. 아, 맨날 이 자리. 남진이가 저기 앉아서 쫙 이렇게 쫄쫄쫄. 아 그렇죠. 약간. 그렇죠. That's crazy. 저거 돈독 비빔밥. 스테이크 돈독 비빔밥. 비빔밥. 네. 저희 저기 걔네들 때문에 만든 거예요. 그러니까. 그러니까 원래는 없었어. 맞아. 원래는 쌈밥만 있었어. 쌈밥만 있었는데. 아. Man, I'm hungry. I want Korean food so bad. That looks so good. <laughs> BTS <laughs> meal. BTS meal. 
예, 각지에서. 그렇지. 뭐, 뭐 광주, 대구, 부산, 부산 일산, 원주. 그래, 너 나겠죠. 아. 친구들의 열정에 내가 부족했던 거지. I wasn't as passionate. See? That's a big deal. It is a big deal. It's like you got to be passionate about what you do. And if you are not someone else that is more passionate than you, maybe is less talented than you, not saying that the members are more, but um, that's what happens, right? <laughs> This is like a life lesson. It's just like if you're more passionate about something, you will take more time to develop your skills into it. You will take more effort. You will put more forth. And that's just the way it is you know you may have more talent quote unquote more like innate ability but if someone over 10 years works harder than you because they're more passionate about it wants to spend all their time thinking about that then they're gonna end up being successful and um in this case you know that may not have been it maybe it was but i just think it's a good lesson to take from this <laughs> Yeah, They all look young, that's true. 공공기관, 이제 한국 보험국 재료공단이라는 곳에서 이제 인턴을 하고 있고 음. 어, 지금 회사에서는 웬만하면 되게 조용히 다니려고 하고 있고요. 원하는 게 아닌 것 같다는 생각이 자꾸 들더라고요. 그래서 뭐 유튜브를 더 열심히 하고 So what do you, why do you guys think that people want to be famous? Comment down below. Because I think that's so interesting that fame is something that people want. You know, they, they want to be famous. Um, that's so interesting. Like he, he, didn't, he doesn't want necessarily want to be rich, but he wants to be famous. I get the feeling of wanting to be known for your art, um, you know, be validated for your art and your, and your songs. In my case, my music. Um, I just wonder why we have that desire. Mm-hmm. 양쪽으로 좀 크게 크게 가려고 열심히 노력 중이에요. 저에게 이제 진짜 가장 큰 꿈은 그거예요. 제가 가장 행복했던 시절, 연습생 때 시절 그 있었던 사람들 있잖아요. 뭐그친그 그 사람들을 한번 이렇게 다 모아서 이렇게 파티를 한번 열어보고 싶은 거. 거기 있던 모든 친구들. 저는 너무 그 시절이 그립거든요. 그게 궁극적인 목표가 될 yeah. 줄은 몰랐어요 저도. 근데 그런 게 있잖아요. That's interesting. It's in, it seems like he was probably the member, the one member that looks back fondly and kind of does regret that he wasn't chosen. Um, the other guy seemed more like at peace with his life, but um, the one the video is about, he seems like no, I, I definitely would have would be happier if I was part of BTS. But who knows, right? We we don't know that. We don't know if that that's true or not, because it you know we have to be in the present too. <laughs> 그 꿈을 향해서 달려갔을 때 옆에 있었던 사람들이 제 꿈이 된 거예요. 어떻게 보면 지금. That is so interesting. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you watch this video here, and I'll see you guys next time.